Everyone all right? Hey, everybody. Yeah, it's your boy Panic calls, Knife, and I'm back here with fine. The Walking Dead, yeah. episode uh, five, okay. I think. And uh, we're back in uh, the pharmacy, and we're about to go out here? and try to get the, Why? I think we're trying to go get the pills for the douchebag that hates me. The next door but, of business yeah. is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Yep, see? I didn't lie. This is going to be interesting. I, I think episode two seems to be one of the tougher to rest, huh? parts to not be a total, or to, to actually be a total douchebag, which is my goal in this series, of course. So I, I just th I think it's a little bit tougher than normal, and uh, should be interesting. Let's see. Uh, I think we just got to go outside here, How and uh, good. That's go have a look around pretty much outside. the start of it here. We got to go. I, I think what I'm going to have to do is let's have a look around. You know, turn on that. Okay. Um, Turn on the, la the the TVs and stuff like that, and distract the zombies over there. So I can't care. reach that brick. Can't reach it, baby. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. <laughs> Hint. <laughs> All right, let's open the shit. Yeah, open, awesome. bitches. Now to distract those things with the brick clamps. Let's use can't that, reach that brick. brick. Oh, I guess I gotta open it a little bit. Not too surprising. Although, that seems to be like an obvious step. I like how we, we're just kind of sitting here. The zombies are right outside the fucking gate. And we're just, you know, chilling. Trying to survive for this guy. I, I also wonder what the fuck we're gonna do once the uh, this guy is saved. Considering we can't lock the motherfucking gate. Why we're saving a guy... It's a complete douchebag. He tried to kill me like seven times. Actually, I think we tried to beat him up. I don't know. Works for me. Oh, yeah. Those zombies love some static bitches. All right. So now I go over and uh, I think just go and grab the keys off the brother zombie. And uh, we'll see. Run to the Lee's brother. Be careful. Thanks, buddy. Keep an eye out, will you? Yeah. Keep a fucking eye out. Grab a gun. Oh, wait, you don't have one because you're fucking useless. Oh, I'm just being a dick right now. <laughs> Alright. So, yeah. That's my brother. He's just trying to eat my face. Hey, bud. Yeah, bud. Stop trying to eat my face. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So, yeah. That's touching. <laughs> that's what happened. Except, probably not. Give me a second. Yeah. Shut the fuck up, dog. <laughs> I got to do this now, man. I got to do this. Hard, cold motherfucker. So let's uh, chop his head off, eh? Sounds like a good time. It's like a fucking party. Damn. Oh, God. That's nice. How's he? Yeah, let's say you, you stabbed him in the neck, dude. You chopped the head off, bitch. Or you could just attack him once in the brain, but you know, technicalities. What are you gonna do? Come on, just chop it off, motherfucker. I, I've seen. Uh, <laughs> there we go. See, that's what I'm saying. You just had to hit the head once. And I've seen uh, Game of Thrones enough to know that if you just hit it really hard, it'll knock the. Uh, Knock the head clean off, so. Clearly, uh, Lee is no Eddard Stark. There we go. I mean, you're taking a million years. Just go back. Holy Run crap. over the fucking Run. road. You loser. Why are you yelling, Doug? You're attracting zombies, son. Clearly, they wouldn't have done this had... We not yeah, see great, now the the gate is open and they're gonna be at the front door. Man, that pretty was good plan. But we did it. It's all that matters. Are they just gonna ignore me now that the door is shut? I hope so. I've but the doubt it. Great. God, you're amazing. <sighs> Lex baby, you can reward me later. All right, so I go over here. I guess just open the door, right? Key. Woo. -hoo. Why did I just use the axe? I guess it's might it might be a metal door. And I walk in. Oh right. Oh, no. Pharmacies have alarms. Dipshit. 
Alright, so. Oh no. Gotta go get those pills so that I can save a guy I don't even like. Hooray. And now, zombies are waking up all over the place, even though that one has a screwdriver in her back. Why does that zombie have a screwdriver in her back? Why would the person not, uh, like, attack her head? Or her eyeball? Or anything other than her shoulder? <laughs> That's, like, the dumbest thing I've ever seen. Although, maybe she died like that. That would be a really horrible way to kill yourself. Stab yourself with a screwdriver? I mean, you'd think there's better ways to do it, right? Well, it gives you a handle if she, uh, if she gets close. Uh, you can probably get your hand it, but, you know. Oh shit, they're all around us, baby. Now we gotta run the fuck away. Well, <laughs> dilly dallying. Listen to him. You're cute. I'd like to get the fuck out of here, like, now. What defense <laughs> Fucking destroyed the, the, the lock like an idiot. Just to save that douche. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as All I can. Right. Now let's go lean up against the fucking door, I guess. Uh, I'm replacing the chick. The chick is useless. No, I'm replacing Glenn? What the fuck? Dumb. We don't make it through this. What's up, Doug? I think you're a great guy. Yeah, exactly. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. What, does she want to bang you? I was trying to I was trying to I slam my keys because I that's usually I said I should know. Oh shit. They're going through the bookshelf. Well, how did we not see that one before? Oh, she can shoot. I guess. That's good. Can you look for something to stick in between the hands? Look at the fucking uh cane. Check. Girl. Slam shot. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, I'd say that window is broken as well. Why am I? Hold on. This is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. Why are you going to leave me alone? Slam it shut. That's what I'm talking about. Click to action beast. Oh, shit. Gotta click that. <laughs> and throw it in there. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, God. Oh, God. Definitely gotta protect the chick because she's got a gun and I'm making excuses for her. It's so sad. I have to choose life or death. Who do I choose? Uh, Carly. It's not even, I don't even have to make a second thought on that one. <laughs> Give her some ammo. Pop. Pop. And then, yeah. See ya, Doug. See ya and your terrible plans for uh, getting kills. Oh my god. Although, uh, she's not going to be go. too happy with me for a little while, I'm guessing. I guess we'll see. They got Doug. They did. Oh shit, they gotta kill that zombie. You got my girl. Boot to the fucking face. And then run the fuck away. Aw, oh, dude, I was. I, should, I, I had my click up there. I could have knocked his ass out. Okay, anybody? Anybody can save me? Whoa. Ah, thanks. <laughs> I, I kind of made him, uh, made some asshole decisions when it comes to Kenny, so I was kind of thinking that he was going to hit me, but yeah, no big deal. Alright, shut the door, and I am out of here. And I think that might be the end of episode one. Interesting. So we're going back to the motel, which is makes perfect sense considering there were like five billion zombies over here and all but you know no big deal <laughs> I guess we're dragging them off piling them up I guess you burn them right gotta burn them she's gotta ew my hands disgusting I have zombies on my hands I, I still don't understand how Kenny's wife is like Russian it's weird Katja Glenn in his pizza car. That's not racist at all. Why would you rip yourself off that picture, you dupe shit? God. Look for a way to take advantage of that, Lee. Or steal their guns or something. Anyway. 
I guess it's not the end of the episode yet. Hey, Glenn. What's up, Glenn? I think I need to go. I've never heard the catastrophe so scale. I'm gonna throw it yeah. up there. <laughs> I got friends there. And I just stage can't nine stay here knowing that or they stage can be eight. What the fuck city. is the difference? Sounds like nobody. It's a zombie apocalypse. Really, guys? Really? Days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Yeah, I guess that's how he gets to Atlanta. That's how he gets to save Rick Grimes. It's gotta go, baby. You gotta go. I think you're making the wrong call. Maybe. But I'd rather make the wrong call and no than make the right call and not. I respect I guess that's one you way to say safe. it. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. With the girl from upstairs. Well, she was bitten by a motherfucking zombie. Let them? Of course she gave up. You told Carly to get her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. You shoot her in the face. Anyway, see you around. All right. I guess Glenn is off in his pizza car. I could really go for some pizza right now. Like, really go for some pizza. I'm fucking starving. Shit happens. Look at that. That's nice. Uh, so now I get to go and clean up the messes that I made. Hey, kid. What's up, Ken? Close call back there. Let's go on to your Thanks fishing boat there, there, Slick. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yep. Yeah, we do. We do. I think you know what you're doing. Should Damn right I do. Any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures things out. That girl's gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. Until I start capping bitches at the party, which is bound to happen pretty soon. I hope I don't have to talk to Katja. Right, I guess I get to go talk to Carly. Yeah, what's up, baby? How you doing? How you doing, Carly? <laughs> he said it just like I'm I okay. did. How you doing, you know, Carly? Considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved Stop him. Stop thinking we? about him. He's dead. Think Stop so. thinking about him and start thinking about me, baby. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a. It's just that. I think that I liked him. Really? You'll be alright. Yeah. Definitely. Anyway. <laughs> You'll be alright, baby. I, think. I understand. For now. Wait. It's a me? chick thing. What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. Because you've got a you gun, baby. I was going to help you both. But you <laughs> helped me yeah. first. Yeah, I did. You got the I gun, baby. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Seriously, though, like, just out of a decision uh, from, you know, somebody who's being pragmatic, this chick's got a gun. She's a better shot. He's just some random nerd. I mean, why, why wouldn't you save the chick with the gun, right? Because the gun, you're not going to go back and get the gun after it's on the ground, you know, in the middle of a bunch of zombies and shit. So, you kind of just got to choose the one. <laughs> hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. It's a super dinosaur. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's, I got grabbed again. But I got I you, baby. there, though. I fell. And my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. <laughs> I know I need That's to all you tough. can say to girls, I'm I guess. Just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. Yep, it's they gone. sure are, baby. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. And just play with your Lee, broken walkie-talkie. Let, let me go deal with this. I'm gonna go beat oh, the shit out of some old man. Another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill <laughs> himself. Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. Oh, shit. You hear me? I'm gonna throw some threats back at you, bitch. I know who you are. Good. And Fucking give better a shit learn it. What happens to you? But if anything happens Learn my, to my name, daughter, bitch. That little girl you've got with you? 
You watch your ass. You watch your ass, son. Oh, I didn't even get to like get some witty hey, comeback at him. That me? sucks. Do you have a second? Yeah, I got a, I got a minute for you, baby. I could even get 20 minutes for you. My I don't even dad know what that means. <laughs> for you. Damn right it would. I should have fucking Doug killed him. Dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. We're lucky to have you. You're damn right you are. You're damn right, because I'm a bad motherfucker. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Kind of doubt it. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. Yeah, I'm sure that's going to happen pretty I soon. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. All right. Well, it looks like we are done with episode one. Hope you guys enjoyed it, everybody. I'm going to keep going through until, I guess, episode four just came out this week. So I'm going to go through episode four, and then I'll finish up with ex episode five when it comes out. Uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed the videos. This is your boy, Pancake, and I am... Actually, I'll show you guys the, the decisions that I made based on the, um, the shit, and I'll, we'll see the, the preview the here, so I'm going to shut up. Never I, don't want to to Ooh, it's I want you to have this, okay? Hungry. In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything. Girl. Yeah, that didn't happen I last time. Just want to throw that out there. I'm and my other point there. <laughs> we got to get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. Don't repeat what happened with the walkers at Herschel's farm. You choose the kids this time. Something's <laughs> coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The walkers don't worry as much as the bandits. Fucking bandits. For help. Yeah, that'll come up uh, probably this week as well. I'll uh, take a break after episode four, but we will definitely go through this whole series. Anyway, this is fun because I uh, I didn't actually I, I chose decisions that uh, fewer people chose on three of them, but you know the two of the two of the main decisions I was actually with everybody, even though I'm trying to play as an asshole. I guess I'm doing a bad job at it. Anyway, with theawfulgamer.com, it's your boy Panic Knife. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and have a good night. Like and subscribe.